Okay. So now we're going to be again working on the back on the wings for the backpack. And there's a lot of parts here. A lot. I know there's a lot similar to that on the master grade and I believe on the real grade, but <sighs> wow, there's gonna be a bit of a chore here. So we already got this taken care of. Uh, put the this part here for the detail and this part here for the cover. That's easy. And we have this. It goes Oh, again, same locking mechanism, so turn that like that. Then we're going to have to open this up carefully. There we go. And then that one goes there. Here. <clears throat> and there we go. I'm supposed to pivot and turn like that. Let's get the other one done. So, find the notch, stick it in there, turn it. And then slowly but surely open this up. Carefully. And then that one goes here. And that one goes there. Close it up. Alright. The rail cannons are done. Very simple. Now. this and we take this we put that here but for that to work we need to remove these two parts carefully ah. and then once you do that put that right there and seal it up, like so. Oh, come on, get in there. There we go. And line it up properly. Good. That's one, two, three, four. All four wings are now done for these. But that means we're not done with this kit yet. Oh no, we got more to go here. So with this, we start, might as well put these on, the clear parts. Get over here. Um, oh, it's in a specific position, I believe. There we go. That goes there. Yeah, one's different from the other, so you gotta be very careful. That goes there, and that goes there. <laughs> okay. Now, we did all that. So I'm make sure that I'm looking, I'm reviewing the manual right now. Okay. We need to take this one apart now. Come on, get up. There we go. And we need to attach. So if it's in this position, then this has to be like that. Or not. I think it's the other one. We'll use the other one. And yeah, that position. Yep. Yeah, Make sure 
sure that I'm looking at the manual correctly. You know, you would think that an SD kit would not take this long, but of course it's going to take this, this long. Didn't, uh, didn't realize it until now, but you know, what do you, get, what do you expect? I wonder if it's going to take this long when I, make, when I get my hands on the Barbie. Because I know a lot of you guys are going to get the Barbie too. Uh, no, it's... Actually, no. This is right. Yeah, I'm sorry. I was, like, looking at the wrong direction. All right, fair enough. <sighs> All right. Now, then. <clears throat> we take him. Like that. Then we take this part here. Put it there. Then we have the this part, the black part. Put it in there. Um, wait, wait, wait. All right. So I did that, right? This is the wrong one because it has to be uh, supposedly aligned like that. There we go. All right, so that's one done. Let's do the other one. Now we got to keep it consistent because sometimes I notice that. When I was assembling these other blades, these, one is, two of them were different from the other. So just be very careful with that. Alright, so this covers this. Supposedly. Alright, we'll get the other one. See in that in that angle. All right, there we go. Push it in all the way. Okay. Now with that being here, we take this locking mechanism. There, and then bring it about. Right? No. No, I made a mistake. Ah. Pick it up later. It's this way because of the angle. Bring this around like that. And then on the next page. We have the circle part. Here and like that, we have this that goes like this again, blocking mechanism. Then bring it down like that, bring it down, and then since okay, so that part is done. We need to do the other one. I'm going to make sure we're in the right. Was it this one or was I using the. If I was doing, oh, I was doing it this way, so that would be. Now I gotta go back and you know what? It it doesn't say do this four times. Oh, I see it in the next page, so that's why. So we do that. 
Take this around, go like that. There's the part right there. Then connect that here and here. Put this in there. I got it. Get in there. There we go. Something like that. And then I believe we take this. Oh, you put it in there. Ah. But no, that's not right. No, no, no. Get out. 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 Yeah. Thank you. This one because if this is in this position because I know I got to turn it that way like that then this goes here like that and then bring it down and then bring it down bring it down and then we find the notch and then we turn it oh boy And there it is. And there it is. And then this part supposedly goes here, but that's you know that's to lock in to the to the uh, backpack. So here's one wing done, and here's the other wing. Oh boy! <clears throat> I'm not gonna, I was not gonna waste a lot of time for you guys to watch me build two wings. But yeah, looks beefy and and well structured. Uh, and of course, I'm noticing some inconsistency with the paints. But you know that that's more my fault. Anyway, the wings are done. Let's move on to the next part of the build. Okay, so the next part of the build is going to be the assembly of the weaponry and the backpack. And uh, for this, I'm going to have to pop this guy open a bit. Hopefully it will allow me to. Thank you. Oops, there we go. And the reason why is because we need to do this. Put that here. Then the red trim part, which quite frankly, all you do, all you need is this. I didn't realize until now. So all you need is that painted. There's nothing around here. And it's like, why bother? All right. So once that's done, put it together like so, and that's it. There is a bit of a detail here that maybe you want to. Um, put something there, I don't know, but that will be, of course, during the panel lining phase. Now we take this trim part here, and then this red part that goes right over it. And you flip it about. You take this, put that there, and this, slide that through here. There we go. The shield is done. Beam rifle. I'm going to take this off. Because I need to put this one on. Right over it like that. It's a very loud prop engine. And then this goes right on top of it. Right there. There we go. 
Be my will done. Scroll so back a couple of pages so we can get to the backpack. Uh, this has already been pieced some old, but I believe we gotta do that first. And, oh, wait, first we need this. And this, put that in there. There we go, that goes there. And then, um, like that. That goes there, I guess. This one we have to take apart. Um, Slowly, good. Then that goes here. And then that one goes there. Followed by these two parts that go to the side. And there is a locking mechanism, so you gotta find the lock, there we go, and then turn, turn, and I think that's it, now, the backpack goes like that, you know what, we're going to put these on, because otherwise it's going to be a hard time to put it on if the backpack is on the body, so I'm going to take these two guys off, and then, Squeeze it in there. And then lock it into place like so. I'm going to say this though. you They're so tight in there. You don't have to worry about it to break. But be careful. Especially when you use straighter. You tend to break things. go. Alright. Nice. Very, very nice. Backpack. Ready. Wings. Ready. Shield. Ready. Beam rifle. Ready. Well, what can I say? Let's now put this kit together and see how it looks.